bring in the Republican Congressman uh, Scott Perry from Pennsylvania. He's also a member of the House Oversight and the Intelligence Committees. Uh, and, you know, nothing did happen, right, because they, didn't, they never did locate him. Uh, let's start there and what you take away from today. Well, the fa failures have been breathtaking, and today's hearing underscores what we already knew and actually makes it worse. Every single person that, that knows anything realizes, as Senator Durbin said, there's not many things I agree with Senator Durbin on, but it's obvious. Right. Nobody brings a rangefinder to a presidential uh, event like that and, and avoids scrutiny. And the fact that they couldn't communicate, didn't have a meeting with the local police, or in some respects blaming that, that fact, you know, that they didn't have a conversation with the local police as the suspicious person was being sought after. This is the Secret Service's job. It is their responsibility. They're the ones that are supposed to make sure that these things are handled and taken care of or locked down. And, it, you know, it, you can't blame it on somebody else. It's their job to make sure that the job gets done, whoever is doing it. And, and it's, a, it's pretty apparent that well, I will tell you this. I, I don't know. Uh, we, we have yet more to find out, and I'm sure we're going to be more aghast as we do find more things out. But it seems like it just seems like they were they had this attitude. Well, whatever happens, happens at this rally with President Trump. If, uh, you know, if uh, if bad things are going to happen, well, you know, we're present. We'll we'll do what we can, uh, you know, after the fact. But it doesn't seem like they did anything proactive to actually protect the president or the people that were at the rally. Well, thanks so much for watching. Just go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.